Hello, welcome to Skillbell Tutorials. This is Arun here with Liferay 6.2 Development Tutorials, session number 16. In this session, we are going to learn how to use finders in the service builders. So here we have the service.xml file and I'll just brief you what is the finders. If you want to have some uh, small custom uh, queries that is customized uh, currently we have seen uh, we have uh, selecting we have been selecting all the uh, data uh, from the database so now we want to have some uh, search criteria kind kind of uh, by id or by some name we want to fetch some data then we can use the finders so we have uh, columns names id and name uh, and uh, by default there will be uh, a search um, search field available for the primary key which you can uh, see at the uh, names service local util you can just uh, just do a um, control space and you can see get names by long names id so this is by default available and or some default stuffs are available already but we want to have something uh, which is really uh, customized um, from our end so that that is what we are going to do so i am i want to search some data using the name field so what i need to do is i need to click on the finders and click the plus button over here and you can add a name for the um, finder so here i'm going to give the finder name as by name and a return type i'm going to give as a collection so why i did a collection as the return type is this collection will be a list of names entity that 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 is what i'm going to get as a return and here what I need to do I need to add a finder column by uh, ex ex exploring this you can see the finder columns you can add the finder column name so this is what you gave the name and now what you can do you can um, once you did all, all these things you, you will be able to build the service again to uh, see uh, to generate uh, your code uh, somehow I am not seeing my build services over here so rather I can do right click life ray and build services so this is another option or another way where, um, where, where I can I can use it for building my uh, services So now my service builder code is running and uh, it has updated some uh, class files and its uh, implementations and there will be a, a class in the implementation of your uh, local service implementation you will be able to see names local service impl so this class is where you have to write your custom method so for for any uh, any entity you will be getting a uh, custom implementation class with that entity name plus local service impl so it will be available in the package service dot impl package so this is the package you have to get and here what we are going to uh, give is public and we are going to return sorry we are going to return a list of names the names model we are going to return and get names by name so this is what I am doing I have to pass a string name as well over here so this is my custom method now I will be able to see the custom generated finder for this name so for that what you need to do is you will be having a persistent object which is automatically injected over here 
by the names local service base IMPL, you will be able to see names persistence. Okay, dot, you will be seeing a find by name find by by name so uh, actually uh, my naming convention was a little wrong you, you should get find by name for that you you will you need to do the finder name as name then you will be getting this one by find by name okay so this is going to give you find by name and this will return you a list of names so this code is also you don't need to write and what I'm going to do is I'm directly returning this data from my service layer. So the service layer code has been generated by ser some uh, ser service builder and what you need to do you need to add a try catch and a return null statement. So that's it you have done with your uh, service implementation and this will be available to the interfaces that is the interface which we are using to uh, not actually interface the the code which we are trying to uh, get this get by get names by name that is the local service util so this this class the names local service util class has to get this methods name so that is right now it is not available if you uh, search you cannot if you cannot uh, you cannot see this method is available this method is not available uh, in this class so you cannot see get by name that get by names or that that is not available in this particular uh, implementation so you you will get that done once you build the services so again i am going to build the services build the services you will see there is some modifications going to happen in some classes here's my console okay the build has been successful now and you can see there is names local service util has been updated names local service and there is a um, couple of other classes which which are related to the particular one has been updated so because we have updated the names implementation so all these things will be taken care by the uh, by the by the service builder okay now how we will make use of this particular class is you can now search for names local service util dot get names by name so this is the method which we have returned okay and I have to give a value over here so I'm going to pass a string Arun to fetch the data okay so this has to be a arun list okay so that now I, I i will get a value which is from which is equal to arun so what i uh, what i'm going to do i'm just going to print the size with list arun i'm just going to leave this names list i'm just going to do with all with names arun list so now i will be getting printed only with the name which is equal to Arun. So now I'm I can deploy I, I can deploy the portlet life ray SDK deploy the portlet. So once it is deployed, I will be able to uh, see the name which is Arun, which is equal to Arun into the browser UI. okay now this has been done now i am just clicking on welcome you can see one and arun has came because the size of 
data which is equal to Arun is only one and I, I am going to enter another Arun okay now you can see two times Arun has printed now again I am giving three times so three times Arun got printed over here so if you check the database value it will also be three times entered so this is how you can write your custom finder method using the service builder that's it for this session and uh, in the next sessions we will learn more about service builders and i can show you um, many more beautiful things with the service builder and thank you for watching the skill belt tutorials keep watching keep supporting us leave your comments leave us an email if you want any support if you want any training you can uh, call us or you can email us to the email id which we are provided with this tutorial thank you again